Hi, this is Em from WCCF Tech, and MSI has demonstrated that it's non-K Intel Olive Lake CPU overclocking capabilities on the latest MAG-B660 series motherboards with, an, with its new OC engine. We all love to see when a mainstream and budget tier motherboards allow users to overclock just as well as high-end products. Well, MSI has done that with its new OC engine featured on the MSI MAG-B660M Mortar Max Wi-Fi DDR4 motherboard. The leaker Chill Dog went on to post some pictures of the MSI Mag B660M Mortar Max Wi-Fi DDR4 motherboard, which hosts a range of special features such as the OC engine, which is an external clock generator featured on the motherboard to support non-K BLCK overclocking. Along with this, we get to see pictures of the PCIe Gen 5 clock generator from Renesis, which has been used on this specific motherboard. We were able to get some more information regarding the non-K Intel Alder Lake CPU overclocking support on the Mordor Max Wi-Fi DDR4 motherboard, which shows that the company has also tested their OC engine and published some interesting results. The motherboard maker has been able to achieve a hefty overclock of 5.1 GHz across all cores using a 127.5 MHz BLCK on the Intel Core i5-12400 CPU. That's a 16% clock speed increase for all cores compared to the standard 4.4 GHz boost, which is only valid for one to two cores. MSI also published the Cinebench R23 performance of the overclocked Intel Auto Lake i5-12400 CPU using this motherboard. At stock, the CPU scored 12,525 in the multi-threaded tests, but with the new OC engine overclocking, the CPU achieves a score of 15,843 points, which marks a 26% increase in performance. This will net you a similar CPU performance as the Core i5-12600K with a much higher efficiency but a lower cost. This is fantastic news for budget or mainstream users who have a non-K Intel Auto Lake CPU and want to gain some extra performance. The Intel Core i5-12400F, which is currently listed as $169 US, and the motherboard, which is listed for $159 US, which makes it a decent budget build. Plus, you don't have to worry about the expensive DDR5 memory as the board supports the DDR4 standard. But what do you think? Would you be using this motherboard to overclock a non-K Intel CPU? Let us know in the comments down below, and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon for more fantastic tech news.